everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Angeline and I am the owner of Angelic Creations. So we are back with another Easter DIY video and as always, let's start off with the materials. So I purchased this yarn blanket from Michaels. I have some ribbon that I purchased from the Dollar Tree. Two eggs that I purchased from the Dollar Tree. Came in a pack of about 15 and I also purchased this uh, Easter Bunny uh, refund. And if you cannot find the Easter Bunny refund at the Dollar Tree, you can also check Hobby Lobby or you can check uh, Joanne's as well. Okay, and lastly, you will need some hot glue. Okay, so what I've done so far is unraveled my yarn and I just pulled out the beginning of it. And the first step I'm going to do is just place a dab of glue at the tip of the bunny ear. And I'm going to apply my yarn to the top because I want my whole bunny ear to look full. So you just hold that for a few seconds. And then I'm going to begin to wrap my yarn around the bunny ear. Okay, so this is how we're looking so far. It's exactly how I wanted it to look. It's full and I did not cut off my string. I'm just going to continue over to the next ear doing the same steps okay now we should have something that looks like this both of my bunny ears are complete and they're full now for this um bunny ear all i did was place a dab of glue at the tip of it i pulled over a little bit of the yarn piece and i cut the remaining piece off so now both of them look the same okay, so now we're moving on to the body of the bunny and i'm going to repeat the same steps but only thing i did was i detached a lot of my um yarn from the ball so that i can move a little quicker but I'm going to continue with the hot glue, starting off with it, just a dab of hot glue. You're going to take your yarn, place it over the hot glue for a few seconds. Okay, and once you have applied that, now you can begin to wrap it. Okay, so what do we have here? A teachable moment. So I quickly uh, realized that I should have started with the body of the bunny first and then moved on to the ears. But that's okay. All you have to do is just stop wherever you're going to stop at, which for me is stop there. And then you're just going to repeat the same step and just fill in the two holes. But now you just have two circles instead of three. Okay, so here's the completed look. And of course, you can hang it just as it is, but mm -mm, I can't do that. Now, so I have created some bows to place on my bunny. And don't forget to grab your eggs. So I swapped these out, the yellow ones for um, the pink ones for the yellow ones. It just, I don't know, it paired a little better. I'm a pink girl, so I think everything, you know, everything's supposed to be pink. But yellow was perfectly fine. Now, you can place it at the bottom and make it like um, the tail. And you can add an egg in the middle. Or you can place it in the center here. And then you can add the egg on there. You have so many different options. What I decided to do is I want to use both of my bows and I'm going to place them on both ears. Okay. Okay, so now this is finished, complete and cute. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope that you give it a try. And if you do, make sure you tag me in it. If you have any questions, do not forget to leave them down in the description box. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your family and friends. And also, stay tuned because we have more videos coming soon. Until next time, bye.